Clemso lines. Let us understand how to read these load lines that you find marked on the side of a ship. The purpose of a load line, or a plimso line, is to ensure that the ship is not overloaded and has sufficient freeboard. It indicates the maximum safe draft. and the minimum free board for the ship in various operating conditions. The location of the Plimso line is determined by a classification society after surveying the ship. Plimso line mark allows one to know the safe draft. Draft is the vertical distance between the water line and the bottom of the hull or keel. The heavier the load, the more is the draft length. Plimso line allows one to know the free board. A free board is the vertical distance between the water line and the shear of the ship where water can enter the vessel. Plimso line allows one to know the volume of load that is safe to carry. Overloading can cause the ship to sink. There are many load line marks for different density of water or different sea climates. It is important to know that higher the density of water, stronger is the upward buoyant force. The order of less dense water to high dense water is as shown. This means one can load more cargo for dense water. Once having understood that oceans are of different density, each having a safe load line, it is time to understand how to read the lines. The circular symbol with the line passing directly is the Plimso line. The line represents the imaginary water level. The Plimso line is directly below the deck line. The deck line is the freeboard line issued by the Classification Society. The summer load line is the primary mark. It is from this line that all other lines or marks derive. The winter load line is 1 48th of the summer load draft. Placed below the summer line, the tropical load line is 1 48th of the summer load draft. Placed above the summer line. The other load lines are for fresh water. Tropical fresh water. Winter North Atlantic.